Um, hi, um, hi, hi, I, um, uh, really? One, two, three, boom! That's it! In the first three seconds, somebody's just formed an opinion on you based solely on the nonverbal communicating that you're doing. But unfortunately, like 95% of dudes that I see walking around are doing one critically important thing wrong, and that is they are not walking with confidence and the air of alpha. One of the big mistakes that a lot of guys make when it comes to them walking confident is they end up overcompensating and look arrogant and cocky, right? If I walked like this, like Conor McGregor, what exactly? I look cocky, but it works for him, but it doesn't work for you, right? Here's the difference, right? Here's cocky, chest up, walk in with a smug ass look on your face versus this, right? Confident, little smirk, little smile, not too big, not too cheesy. Now, a few things you gotta do groundwork wise. In terms of your style, you've gotta look confident. What happens when you put on a nice suit or an outfit that you know you are killing it in? Boom! You look at yourself in the mirror and you're like, damn, I look good. What happens? Of course, you feel great about yourself. That day you have a great day because you feel more confident. But if you're dressing like crap, if you're dressing like a slob, if your clothes are all wrinkled and ratty and torn up and you're baggy and disgusting, there's zero chance that you're going to walk like an alpha, right? Because even if you mimic the steps and your body language is I, it doesn't matter because your style is whack and people don't respect people with whack style. The next step is to smell amazing because the secret is that for me when I spray on a fragrance that I love right it's like a little instant hit and boost of confidence when I smell myself I feel more confident right now something else that's interesting is that when you're walking right when you pass people people will smell you and if you smell amazing they're automatically going to view you as more attractive and sexier number four is your hair. What's your hair look like, right? Are you confident with the head of hair that you have? And honestly, for me, that's one of my, my things, right? I love my hair. I'm not super tall, but I do have incredible hair. Now, you may be somebody that's like, yo, I don't really love my hair, or you may be insecure about the fact that you're losing your hair, all right? Bottom line, end of story, hit the link, go see Bosley. I'm not gonna get into a whole long pitch, but I just wanna say, I know that hair loss is one of the biggest confidence killers in men. And I know that if you're somebody that's losing your hair, you see a few extra strands in the pillow or in the drain, you are not as confident as you could be. Hair loss sucks, it's a total confidence killer. And the thing that kills me is that it's totally treatable and preventable if you do what you need to do in order to stop it and get your real hair back. Guys, I'm gonna link down below to Bosley. There's a special link down below. If you actually go through there, you can grab the completely free guide to hair loss and hair restoration. You're also gonna get a $250 off gift card. Here's the truth. I don't understand it, honestly. Unless you're like wanting to go bald and if that's you, congratulations. Me, I love my hair, I don't wanna go bald and the one place I will tell each and every one of you to go and the only place that I trust with my hair is Bosley. Guys, Bosley, they are the hair doctors. They've been in the hair loss business for over 45 years. And when it comes to restoring your hair, experience matters. Don't trust somebody that just raised a lot of money in Silicon Valley and it's a tech company. No, 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 no. Bosley, they've got the latest technologies, they've got amazing doctors, and they can help you get your real hair back. But the thing you gotta do is stop ignoring it, stop putting your balding head in the sand and thinking people can't notice. They can notice, she can notice, I noticed. Gentlemen, hit the link down below. Do not wait. Grab the guide. It's free. It's a huge no-brainer. At least grab the guide so you know what we're talking about and dealing with. Guys, now is the time. Do not wait. You deserve to be confident and you deserve to have a head of hair that you absolutely love so that when you're in the mirror being like, damn, mama, right? Or she's running her fingers through those luscious locks. Game over. You win. Gentlemen, if you really want to win, hit the link down below. Grab the guide. Grab the gift card and go see Bosley. Do you think these guys are happy they went to Bosley? Hell yeah, they are. They look absolutely amazing. Your phone in your pocket because confident alphas aren't walking like this right there. No, 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 no. Phone in your pockets. Hands, not in your pockets, all right? Because that's something that makes guys look a little bit weak and like a widow boy. You're not a boy. You're a man. You're confident. You're alpha. Now, are you ready? Are you ready to walk like an alpha? So here's how you do it. Boom. Step number one. Chest up, gentlemen. Not here. Here, right? Also, step number two, head up, chin elevated, not down here, up. Because A, you don't want to look like you got a double chin, and B, when your chin is up and elevated, it makes you look proud, right? Think of looking proud. Not confident, but proud. 
Like, what happens? If you win an award, boom, you're proud, right? Chest is up, heads up. You're like, yeah, I did it, right? That's the way and the manner in which you need to think about walking. You're proud. You just did or accomplished something incredible, right? And then shoulders are going to be back, right? Not hunched, not rounded. In terms of your arms, I did a video, How to Walk Like a Bad Boy. And in there, I tell you to roll a little bit, right? That's what Conor McGregor looks like. He looks like a bad boy. He looks like a badass. Chill that out, right? When you're confident, you don't need to actually do that, right? You're here, you're walking in a nice, confident, even stride. It's all about your upper body, but in terms of your lower body, you got to make sure you're not walking weird, right? Now, what is weird walking? Weird walking is walking too fast or shuffling, right? You want to make sure that you're taking confident, even strides, right? One, two, three. Not too big or else you're going to look like you're weird. Not too little, not too small. Boom, right there. And notice, right, what am I doing with my face? Little smirk. My eyes, they're sparkling, they're shining, they're confident, they're looking people in the eye. And that's the other thing. Guys, when you're walking, if you want to look confident like you're an alpha, an alpha is friendly. He's inviting, he's engaging, he's looking at people, and he makes them feel welcome. He makes them feel important. And that's what you're going to do when you actually look somebody in the eye and a little smirk, right? Not too big and cheesy, you don't need to do that, but a little smirk, right? Check it out. Right there. Yeah. Hold my. Are you kidding me? Did you see that? Right there. <laughs> it was a little, that was a little Zoolanderish. Woo. Mm, right there. <laughs> kind of. But tone it down a little bit, right? Your eyes are friendly. Your mouth, a little bit of a smirk, a little smile, right? Let's put it all together. Gentlemen, here it is. Ready? Boom. Ready? Chest up. Shoulders back. Fix your head. Chin up. Elevate it slightly. Eyes. Sparkling. Smile. Little smirk. And Boom, are you, are you kidding me? Oh my God! That is such an alpha walk, it's ridiculous. It's alpha AF. Gentlemen, ready from the side? You wanna see it? Here it is, ready? Uh-huh, yeah, I can do it any angle. Gentlemen, you gotta get into the habit of practicing a confident walk. Even if inside, you're like, I'm not confident. Even if on the inside, you're not confident, you're scared, little bird, right? No, outside, gentlemen, it's all about perception. When you start making it a point to walk more confidently, you're going to be amazed at what happens. Other people are going to see you and view you, and they're automatically going to be like, damn, he's a confident alpha. Damn, he looks amazing. Damn, I want to make out with him. Damn, his hair's incredible, thanks to Bosley. Damn, he smells amazing, thanks to Pete and Pedro. Damn, his style is sharp as hell, thanks to Alpha M. Why don't we now thank Alpha M by dropping me one of these?